100 subscribers. That, that is absolutely crazy to me. Hello everyone and welcome to IMRT Reviews. IMRT and today we are celebrating 100 subscribers on YouTube. I can't thank you all enough for the support. It's been absolutely crazy. I don't think I'd even have 10 subscribers after four months, let alone 100 subscribers. So I can't thank you all enough. I put out on my Instagram story asking for questions for this Q&A. Came in, you've asked me some questions. So let's answer them. So I've got my phone here for the questions. Let's have a read. Since starting YouTube, what has been your biggest surprise and your biggest challenge? Now, biggest surprise is probably how much I've enjoyed it. I don't think I'd enjoy it as much as I did. It's literally been the highlight of my year starting this YouTube channel and making videos and getting to know people in the community. It's been a lot of fun. So I'd say that's my biggest surprise. I didn't think I'd enjoy it this much. And yeah, I've got a lot of plans and lots of things I want to do with this channel because I just enjoy it this much. And I say the biggest challenge is, I think it's like the mental thing of trying to think that you actually, so like if I'm reviewing a movie, sometimes I think, am I actually talking, you know, talking sense is what I'm talking about, making any sense to people, do I actually know what I'm talking about, it's trying to overcome that, you know, uh, that mental barrier of am I actually doing a good job of what I'm doing. And I, I think I have overcome that. I think sometimes I do doubt myself. I'm like, am I actually making any sense? But, you know, it's something you've got to deal with over time. It's something I'll get used to. And I'm sure, you know, after I've done this for a lot longer, I won't have any, you know, um, thoughts like that. But I think that's probably the biggest challenge is actually thinking, you know, am I, <laughs> do I know what I'm talking about when it comes to movies? And I would also say thinking of content in lockdown because, you know, there's no films to review so I was like what the hell am I doing just started up a movie review channel there's no movies out so that was difficult as well so moving on to the next question it's what's been your favorite release this year so far and what is my most anticipated movie well my most anticipated movie is the Suicide Squad and that's just recently released and it's my favorite release of the year so far that film blew me away I absolutely loved it so my next most anticipated would be Dune, Denis Villeneuve's next film. I think it, as a director, he's phenomenal. I think he's he's very close to being on the same level as Christopher Nolan. I'd say Christopher Nolan's like here, Denis Villeneuve's like there. So a couple more movies from him, and he's going to be right up there with Nolan. And I'm so excited for that film. The trailers for it look insane. The cast is... What a cast. I'm very, very excited to see that on the biggest screen possible. So next question is, when did your love for films start and why? Well, that is an interesting question. I have already answered on this channel in my video, why do I love movies? So if you want to know the answer to that video, uh, that question, check out that video. It's like 11 minutes long and I go deep into my history with movies and it's probably my favorite video on the channel, I'd say. Weirdly enough, the next question is favorite video I've made question mark and as I just said it's definitely the why I love movies video I say it's because it's the most like podcasty feel video on my channel so far and I'm a massive fan of podcasts and uh, something I definitely want to eventually go into with my channel so yeah I'd say that's probably my favorite video so far because it's felt very uh, discussion based and very personal which I did enjoy great question next it's do brits like american accents as much as we like british accents now i can only speak for myself here and i will say that i'm a massive fan of an american accent obviously there's lots of different types of american accents like there are english accents but as a whole i do love an american accent my favorite is probably the southern american accent that you hear in uh, shows like the walking dead great accent Another movie-based question next, which is, do you like movies for kids, like animated movies or cartoons? If so, any favourites? And I'm a massive fan of kids' movies. My favourite franchise being How to Train Dragon trilogy. That trilogy is phenomenal. Like, number two, Tears. Tears the entire time. That is an incredible, incredible film. And my favourite Disney movies being Tarzan, Atlantis, and Treasure Planet. And favourite princess Disney movies being Tangled and Frozen. As you saw in my Blu-ray collection video, I had lots of Frozen movies. You know, I've got the, uh, the short movies as well. Because I have no shame in how much I like Frozen. There you go. 
Next question is, what inspired you to start YouTube? Now, you know, I've got a bit of history here. When I was 14, I remember coming home from school and watching this person called Syndicate on YouTube. He had a Minecraft series, and I was like, okay, I want to do YouTube. And that progressed into me watching movie reviewers like Jeremy Johns and Chris Stuckman. And I was like, I really want to talk you know, movies on uh, the internet. I just never did it for a very long time. And then in lockdown, I was like, let's buy the stuff let's do it let's live with no regrets and you know i've started it and that's that's why i'm here now doing the q a because i actually uh you know bit the bit the bullet and actually went for it and uh, i'm enjoying it very very much i love youtube i love everything about it uh, i've got so many heroes like youtube wise you know like i said syndicate chris stuckman uh, randolph pokemon i'm a massive fan of uh, yeah i just like youtube a lot that leads into the next question of what made you decide to start reviewing movies now a massive chris stockman fan that's what i said on my why i love movies video and i'm a massive movie fan believe it or not and i was like you know what i want to talk about movies on the internet i want to build a community around it i want to get movie lovers into this channel just talking about movies talking about the things they love and get passionate about it and that is, you know, that's the beauty of YouTube. You can bring people with shared passions together. And that's what I want to do with this channel. Build a community and talk about the things we love, which are movies. Next question is, what is the best horror movie I've seen this year? And I've not seen that many horror movies this year. I've only seen The Conjuring Old, if you want to call it a horror movie. And the Fear Street trilogy, I'd say the best out of all of those would be Fear Street Part 1, I think. That had the best slasher movie vibes and I think, that is probably the best of the trilogy for me personally anyway i had a lot of fun with that movie so we've got two more questions to go the first one being when will we be getting more of the masterpiece collection series and if you haven't seen that on my channel before it's where i review all of my favorite movies of all time and to answer your question they will be coming soon i've got a list of films that i want to review for that series i'll read off a couple we got la la land harry potter and the Pris a prisoner of azkaban serenity uh, the Captain America, The Winter Soldier, Infinity War, Jojo Rabbit, Mad Max Fury Road, to name a few. So yeah, they will be coming back. I just need to find the time to do them, really, and not be lazy. So yeah, they are coming back. Do not worry. Coming down to the final question now, which is, do you have a second love after movies? And I do. It is boxing. Boxing is my favorite sport by far. I try and check out every single fight that I can. I watch all the interviews on YouTube with all the fighters. I absolutely love the sport. So, they are all the questions for this video. I hope you enjoyed this Q&A. Once again, I've got to say thank you for all the support. It means the world to me. I absolutely love this YouTube channel. I love talking movies and I love getting you know involved with the community. The community is so great in the, the movie world on YouTube and I love talking to you all. So, thank you for the support once again. 100 subscribers that is just crazy to me absolutely crazy if you did like this video please give it a like make sure to subscribe and i'll see you next time